Hi everyone, Amanda from Framework here. In this video, we'll feature a tour of our e-signing solution that we have selected at Framework Foundation. There are several e-signing solutions available today. We've selected EchoSign for its ease of use and its integration with Salesforce.com. Here's the challenge with our Time Razor events. Signing contracts across multiple time zones with hundreds of artists in seven cities across Canada is a big time consumer. I'm sure you can relate to all the time it takes to draft contracts, send them to the right email, and then wait to get all the correct paperwork back in a timely manner. This way of signing and receiving contracts is known to us at Framework as the old way. In this process, we draft a contract, create the PDF, send it to an artist. The artist then receives the contract, reviews, prints, and signs it. Then, he or she must scan the contract back to us and save it to their computer. Sending it back to us can take a while, sometimes days to weeks, until we receive either the fax or the email signed contract. Then once we get the contract back, we upload it to one computer, so it's locked in one place, or we print it and store it in a binder where it lives on a shelf somewhere. You can imagine that the old way of signing contracts can be quite a lengthy process. The entire process can take one to two hours of staff time per artist contract, plus days to weeks of lag time waiting for signed contracts. Okay, so let's walk through a demo of the new, much faster way of processing artist contracts. Let's open up my contact record in salesforce.com. And what we're looking at here is Framework Foundation's instance of Salesforce. One reason why we're big fans of EchoSign is because of the deep integration with salesforce.com. The app exchange is great, isn't it? So Amanda here needs to be sent an artist contract. So as I'm loading our contact record, you'll find the agreement tab that's embedded in this record, right here. Let's get started in filling out some of the contract details. What we're looking at here is a new agreement form. I'll start by filling out the agreement name, which is important because it determines the signature content. I also want to make sure that I include a personal message. We can select the signature type. In this case, e-signature, it's the big time saver. We also have the option of having the sender sign the contract and determining the signature order. In this case, it's not necessary. So I hit save on the contract details and now it's time to attach the contract. So I'll just pull up my trusty test contract here and attach the file. Once it's uploaded, which you'll see was very fast, I'll click done. We're very excited for EchoSign to include Google Docs functionality to the attach file function. Once it's uploaded, we click send for signature. Yep, it's pretty much that easy. So we've already sped up the time it takes to get an art, a contract out to the artist. Now let's see how much time it takes to get the artist to get the contract back to us. I'll just launch my email and we'll sign the contract. And here's the contract waiting for me in my email. And you'll see the message asking me to review and sign it. So I'll click to open the contract. I have the opportunity to review the details as I'm doing here. And then click to e-sign. And there's two ways to sign your name. You can either type in your signature, as I've done here, or you can draw it electronically. I think in this case I'll type it and click apply. That's it. If I want to do one more review before I send it off, I can. Make sure the date, my name and address are correct. And I'm good. Click to e-sign. And we're done. As an artist, I've successfully signed this contract and know that copies will be mailed to myself and back to framework. You can see that we've gone from a process that takes weeks to process to a model that can literally be completed in seconds. What's great is framework and myself both have copies of the contract. If I go back to my email, you'll see that I have a copy of the signed contract in PDF form for my own records. And framework has a copy of the contract and all the transaction records. 
Another great bonus of embedding EchoSign within Salesforce is that we have a complete transaction record of the contract that all staff can see. We can see when the contract was opened, viewed, and signed, in addition to viewing a JPEG image of the contract itself. Signed, of course. No more printing paper contracts, looking for dated records, and look how much time we've saved.